Innovations in transportation technology are at an unparalleled high, with creative solutions being crafted to help us get from one point to the next, but using efficiency, ease and safety for propulsion. These transportation technologies are ranging from autonomous vehicles to a switch from gas gulping to electric cars, or using technologies such as artificial intelligence, augmented reality and mobile apps to enhance the driver's experience. Here in Jamaica, as we push to join in on this global move, we've launched our very own online training app for public passenger vehicle or PPV operators, dubbed the TA PPV Train app. Edifocal has partnered with the Transport Authority and BCIC to create the TAPPV train learning app. Now, what this does is it came as a direct response to the COVID pandemic because before the PPV operators were accustomed to doing their classes um, in a face-to-face -face setting. So there was a direct need now to bring the training to them virtually. And so that is where this whole partnership came into being, where we created the content, um, put it in a virtual format, also put it on the platform so that it would be readily available to the PPV operators um, for them to be able to, you know, continue upskilling and reskilling. The app is being used to facilitate PPV drivers training in the use of the road code, defensive driving and customer service by way of a gamified format. But the features are far more futuristic and trailblazing. We took a simple, sophisticated approach when designing this app. Um, we wanted to make sure that everything that they need is available to them. So it would be as simple as them just logging in to the portal. They just log on to the, 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 the app domain, tapvtrain.com. They'll be prompted to enter their username, which is their TRN, and their password would be the receipt number that they'd get from um, Transport Authority. So when they pay for the course, they go to Transport Authority and pay for the course, they'd receive a receipt number that would serve as their password or their access pass to the app. Once they log in, all the courses are there. It's a series of um, four courses spanning um, delivering co um, quality customer service, maintaining professionalism, defensive driving, and there's also a module there that um, seeks to inform them about the rules and the functions of the Transport Authority. And here's possibly the best part for PPV drivers using this app. It's completely zero rated. So what that means is on all mobile networks, whichever mobile network um, you're, 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 you receive service from, you'd be able to access the platform without even having data on your phone, without even having to have um, service on your phone. So, I mean, you know, that is one of the things that makes this app so revolutionary in terms of it being fully, fully, fully accessible because we have to consider persons living in areas where there might be challenges accessing internet and we want to make sure that everybody gets a fair chance to be able to access the information. And the security plan for your data was a strategically thought out one. The data is stored on our servers that are encrypted and we have taken um, stringent um, cyber, pro um, cyber protection and, and privacy measures to ensure that, you know, we have secured ourselves and secure or secured our, our, our users' data from any potential um, attack. Engagement has been hitting an all-time high with more and more PPV drivers signing on to this revolutionary idea. Prior to launch, we had a beta test um, control group who viewed the content and you know the feedback was really overwhelming and great so what is happening now is we are in the process of onboarding a little bit over 2,000 PPV operators now to serve as our first cohorts. This 13 million dollar game changer for our transportation industry represents the Ministry of Transport's push to use technology to improve and strengthen its operations. By March of this year all drivers and conductors will be able to fully unlock its functions right from their iOS and Android powered devices.